Hi Duck audience, welcome back, well, yeah, welcome to part two of how to start a nightclub. Um, so in the first part, I kind of, I kind of explained um, the process to getting it, how first you have to buy your nightclub, and then you have to complete some missions, collect the people, collect your uh, music, and then you can finally, you have to then collect your DJ, and then um, once I did that, I uh, completed my nightclub. So it's up and running. Um, DJ, my first DJ was Solomon, the guy I picked up in the last video. Uh, so anyway, this is in part two, I am just showing how to run it. So in the bottom right uh, corner of the screen, you can see where my popularity is and where um, how much money I'm earning. Right now, my popularity is eh, a little bit below 50%, so I'm not getting as uh, much. I think the most is $75. I mean, <laughs> $75,000. So, of course, when you first start out, your um, popularity is at full percent, but uh, as you go along, it starts to drop three levels I want to go to the first level I don't even know why I bought all these levels I should have just waited but um the computers in your basement levels are they work faster and more efficiently so that's where I want to be right now I have no stock uh, I have to hire people but <laughs> I'm broke so but anyway um to increase your popularity right now my whole nightclub has earned $102,000, and that's just in 24 hours. Um, and then, when you go to nightclub management, you can promote the club by doing some type of mission. Um, I've done some, I think I've done two missions, or maybe three. I've done, I done like, four missions but I've only passed like two or three missions and when you don't pass the mission your levels go down instead of going up so that's something if you're going to do the mission just make sure <laughs> you can do the mission also you can go to the DJ um, right here I bought this DJ for a hundred thousand they all cost that so I'm gonna go ahead and collect well okay This is so in this one. This I gotta do this mission real quick, but you have to track down a truck that has a certain card so you can pick up the DJ. I already paid for the DJ. Now I have to do this mission to collect him, and I didn't pass it the first time. Hopefully, I'll pass it this time. But this is also another way to um, so. <laughs> oh there's the car so now I have to go find that car so let me just find it so here's the car it's supposed to be on the track and once you shoot the hinges you're supposed to uh, get inside the car um, it's one of these hold on let me find it there we go and then now I pick up my DJ so yeah let me just go pick up the DJ so here is the DJ or this is that one guy, but uh, I made it. And this is what you had to do with the first guy, uh, Solomon, my current DJ right now. So I, th I think you have to do this with everyone, but I will confirm it. Um, so yeah, these two DJs are the DJs that I purchased. And then, if I ever wanted to get back to Solomon, I can just get um, book him again. But instead of one hundred thousand, he will be ten thousand. So that's good. Okay, so here we are back at my club, and um, so let me go check on my popularity. But um, yeah, I'm pretty sure you have to do a mission. Um, to get these uh, new DJs, 
And in the end, I guess it's worth it. If all you care about is popularity, then money shouldn't be an issue. But if you um, are worried about money-wise that you can't pay it, then I would just recommend doing the missions, even though sometimes they're hard. So as you can see, my popularity is all the way up. Um, another way to get more popularity is by booking and rebooking DJ. So going between one DJ and another let me just show you guys mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so i would do right here rebook for ten thousand rebook again to tell of us it will be ten thousand again i haven't bought these yet but i will later on and but right now i don't need to because my uh popularity is all the way up so it's all good I have I'm not worried now um but anyway that's just the process of increasing popularity and having this nightclub um but there are other things you can do obviously like uh in the basement levels excuse me I currently have three where's the elevator I currently have three but you can purchase more also, um, if you change up your dancers, like going to the website and changing their appearance, it will also increase popularity. Um, also, okay, let me just go back to the computer. It's, I know this video is pretty long, but <laughs> anyway, um, Right here upgrades so if you purchase the staff upgrade it says right here what it will do purchase this upgrade to hire additional bartenders and bouncers this will reduce the daily popularity loss of the club of the nightclub so like every day my nightclub goes down and it goes down pretty like it's a lot kind of so um if i bought this it wouldn't go down as much uh and then equipment upgrade purchase this upgrade to install higher quality equipment this will improve the productivity of your warehouse technician allowing them to uh get the goods faster i currently i don't have any of tech of the technicians because i don't have any goods but i will do a video of uh, once i get those how to get them and what to do with them a security upgrade purchase the upgrade to install security guards and surveillance equipment this will reduce the likelihood of the nightclub being attacked by enemies so um this will probably be my next purchase the security upgrade because i don't want anyone to come and steal my my stuff um but even though right now i don't have anything so once i get some stuff i will then purchase the security but anyway that's it for this video if this helped uh i guess <laughs> it kind of helped me i when i make these videos i'm just learning as i go really but uh, if you like the video, like the video, subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell for updates to further videos, which will be soon. Uh, my next video will probably though will be Minecraft. So, but anyway, until the next video.